Okay, so Charlie Johnson here from CJ Coaching. Just got back from my second training session of the day. So I want to give you guys an update with where I'm at with my training and what I'm doing at the moment. So I've currently been trialing something that's very different and it's training twice a day. Uh, so I've got a bit of a crazy new training that I've been doing. Uh, I'm obviously very fortunate I'm in a position where I can do what I want. Uh, so I can train when I want, he trains when he wants. Um, which is brilliant. So I love training, I love being in a gym, so therefore I have upped the frequency of my training. So I'm trying to do uh, two days a week where I'm doing double sessions, so training in the morning and then in the evening. What I'm doing to accommodate this is to make the sessions slightly shorter. So to give you a run through of my current week of how I've run my last training block training, two sessions, uh, two days with double sessions per week. So on Monday, I've been doing a back session with calves, which is row focused. Uh, so rows. Uh, then on Tuesday, double session day, I'll be doing delts and arms in the morning. And then in the evening, I'll be doing legs, but be more of a pump workout, focusing on extensions and hamstring curls. Wednesday will be a rest day. Thursday morning, I do heavy leg sessions, badass. And then Thursday evening, I do arms and delts. Friday, I do chest and calves. Saturday then would be uh, back, but this be more pull downs and pull over focused, and then Sunday would be rest. So that would be it at the moment for what I've done for the last six to eight weeks. I've had two double training sessions. Um, how have I found that? Phenomenal, to be honest with you. So the type of training I'm doing is not CNS draining, so by that I mean central nervous system. So it's not max lifts, I'm not doing anything less than six reps, I'm not doing heavy deadlifts, heavy squats, anything like that. It's generally a lot more time and attention work, which I personally find has been hugely beneficial and my joints feel great, I generally feel great. The only thing I would say with two per day training sessions is that you can feel a little bit uh, more mentally fatigued because in the morning your adrenaline is shooting up because you can hyped up the train, smash the training session, then you eat, then you chill out, and you just want adrenaline comes down, and then you try and spike yourself back up again later in the day to repeat the process again. That second session can become a little bit difficult sometimes halfway through, you can feel a little bit drained, in particular if you've gone balls out in the morning session. Um, that's the only feedback I've had so far. Like It's just one thing I would say with training twice a day, you have to pay attention on recoveries, you have to have your sleep on point, your hydration on point, and your nutrition on point. Uh, now coming into nutrition, what I've been doing to uh, accommodate the extra training is basically doubling my carbs on training days, which has been awesome because I love eating. Uh, so my carbs on double training days has been 450 grams. Um, so my calories have just done about 3,800 on double training days. So I'll do two training sessions and I'll also go for a morning walk, the CJ Coaching morning walk, which is infamous. Uh, before meal one, because it's great for digestion, it's also good for a little bit of fat burning in there. Um, top tip. Um, so that's how allowed me to push my food up higher, training twice a day, drop my cardio back massively. I've managed to keep my body fat down, I feel like I've ad been adding more tissue. The reason why I feel like I've been growing is the fact that I've, it's given me another two opportunities a week to basically pump my body up full of blood into the muscles, and a fill it full of nutrients when I'm terror training. So what I'm doing in terms of nutrition, I'm splitting my intra workout drink that I normally have um, I normally have 45 grams of carbs into workout. I split them in half and have it half in the morning session, half in the evening session, and then I have the rest of the other like glutamine and creatine have half in each drink as well. It's two more opportunities to saturate my blood with nutrients um, and pump them into the muscles. So when you're training, you push around 77% 70, 70, of the blood in your body into the muscles. When you're just relaxed, it's only 12%. So if you can get all that blood in the muscle, get it all circulating, fill it full of nutrients from the cells receptive to it, you can grow more muscle. So that is one way to add more muscle, which I have been taking advantage of. Uh, it seems to be working really, really well. So that is the feedback I've had so far, my current two per day training uh, session. So that's only two days per week. My next stage I'm about to embark on is I'm going to do four days a week, double sessions, and then one single session a day. So it'll be five training days a week, uh, four of which will be double sessions. So it's been pretty savage. Again, I'm going to push my body as hard as I can in terms of recovery. 
So again, I'm gonna have to maximize my sleep, making sure I'm getting good seven to eight hours of sleep a night, make sure my health cycles are on point, making sure I'm getting regular sports massages, um, doing my prehab, rehab, and mobility work, which I do before every training session, making sure I'm hydrated, and then uh, also making sure that my training technique is bang on. You've got to make the most out of every window of opportunity with training, um, so I'm excited to see what happens. The other thing I'm going to be aware of is just how I feel session to session. So if I'm feeling a bit battered, my legs haven't recovered yet, I'll take an extra rest there if I feel like I need one. So that's my plan for my next phase of double session training. Should you do double session training, train twice a day? I'd give it a go if you're not sure. I'll put the force that I'm using at the moment below in the summary for you guys to give a try. Let me know what you think. If you need any advice on how to push your nutrition for the double split, let me know. Essentially, same as I would with all my current clients, I just push all the carbohydrates pre and post workout. It can be a little bit more challenging, almost try and get the meals in because you spend so much more of the day actually training, not eating. Um, so I would just make sure you have your like, meal timing properly nailed in. But again, you would have carbs pre and post workout after each training session. Um, and ideally, I would try and split the training sessions about six to seven hours apart. So let me know what you guys think. If you guys have any questions in regards to training twice a day, comment below and keep lifting, keep getting shredded, keep enjoying life. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell. Peace out from Charlie Johnson. Let you have me on.